Kuala Lumpur, a cost of living allowance, COLA, of RM 300, 98 day maternity leave, 7 day paternity leave, 30 day paid leave to perform the Hajj and housing allowances based on the cost of living in cities are among the sweeping labor reforms sought by the Malaysian Trades Union Congress, MTUC. The proposals are among those submitted to the government, which is in the process of reviewing three key labor laws, as promised by Pakatan Harapan in the general election manifesto last year. In what it terms as a bid to bring dignity to the Malaysian workforce, which it claims has not been given the rightful recognition, the MTUC has asked the National Labor Action Council to Ensure the government and employers give utmost importance to job security as well as decent work. MTUC Secretary General J. Solomon said the labor laws in Malaysia have become archaic since most of them were promulgated in the 1950s and 1960s. The environment has changed over the years, and there is far greater recognition about human dignity, human values and workers' rights. It is long overdue for a comprehensive overhaul of various labor laws. We thank the Human Resources Minister who has initiated a reform of the labor laws under the new government which MTUC has been championing since 1970s, he said in a statement. The three laws that will be reviewed are the Employment Act 1955, Industrial Relations Act 1967 and Trade Union Act 1959. The MTUC's proposals include extending the coverage of the Employment Act to workers earning up to earn 10000 a month maternity leave to be raised from 60 days to 98 days, and paternity leave of 7 days. Other proposals include, the MTUC is confident that the government and employers will seriously consider the above proposals, Solomon said. He said Malaysia's aim to achieve the status of a high-income nation not only needed quality workers but also quality employers as the workers' well-being and dignity were important for increased productivity. The need to bridge the income gap cannot be prolonged and all stakeholders need to change their mindset in sharing the wealth of the nation equitably as every Malaysian needs to contribute towards the progress of the nation. Workers too should change their work culture and behavior in view of the need for Malaysians to grow and to have a share of the fruits of a high-income nation. Solomon said, he also urged Malaysian workers to put aside all differences and be united to pursue this cause for the better future of their families. We have waited for 60 years to see these labor law reforms and let's do it together and none should disrupt this golden opportunity. We strongly believe we will realize our dream, he added. More on Microsoft News. 31. Simple Ways to Save Money Every Day of the Month Provided by Cheapism